new details on a horrible case of animal abuse. A puppy is getting some much needed care after possibly being shot in the jaw. An animal rescue group founded in the Redland over the weekend. CBS 4's Ted Scouten is live outside of the animal hospital in Hollywood with more. Ted? Well, Jim and Rudabay, right about now, that dog should be going under anesthetic. That way, uh, there can be a better evaluation of exactly how she's doing and what needs to be done uh, to, to basically fix her. Right now, the dog seems to be uh, doing pretty well, despite everything that happened. The question tonight is, will they be able to save her jaw? Hi, baby. I just want to help you. I just want to help you, baby. It's tough to watch a wounded Doberman mix with a serious injury roaming the streets of the Redland. Redland Rockford abandoned dogs was able to capture her. Bonnie Rubenstein and her son Philip were there. When they got close, they realized her jaw was just hanging. She couldn't close it. At that moment, I was about to cry. Like, I was, there was about, about to be a gallon of tears. There's quite a few fractures that are evident. An x ray gives an indication as to what happened. She may have been shot. And we do see some metal pieces inside there, um, indicative possibly a gunshot. We don't really know. Um, but then on top of that, um, she does have half of her tongue to a quarter of her tongue missing. She now has a name, Clover. Vets tell us she appears to be about a year old and is stable. The Doberman Rescue League, Grateful Paws, and Hollywood Animal Hospital are making sure she gets the help she needs. They're trying to determine if Clover's jaw can be saved. We have two routes. We don't know if she'll have the route in which she keeps her jaw um, or if she'll have the route in which she'll get a little bit of a change up and she'll get half of that jaw removed to get rid of the dead tissue and the dead bone. Either way, the outlook is promising for Clover. After treatment, she's going to a foster home. The great thing about Clover and her recovery will be that she's going to not only have the TLC here, she's then going to live with a family in their home and be very comfortable during her recovery. Okay. Oh, good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Hey, girl. Rescuers are just grateful that they were in the right place at the right time to save this young dog. Sometimes it's just in the timing. Sometimes we're early, a little bit earlier, and sometimes we're a little bit later. So yes, yeah, sometimes it's just, it was our luck to be there yesterday. Now, Clover is listed in stable condition. As for her prognosis, she should go on to do great. That is a direct quote from the animal hospital, so that's good news. Now, as you can imagine, uh, care for Clover does not come cheap. If you'd like to help out, if you'd like to donate, go to our website, cbsmiami.com. We have a couple of links for you right there. Live in Hollywood, Ted Scout, CBS 4 News. All right, Ted. Now at